guys. Today I'm going to show you how I make my brownies. They have become a pretty big hit in my household and um, a lot of people have asked me for the recipe so it's actually on my website but I am going to show you um, the ingredients that I use and go ahead and get started and just kind of show you what I do. Forewarning, my house is a little full of puppies, hubby and mother-in-law. So any interruptions, I have no idea what's gonna happen. So just to let you know, dog may bark, someone may cuss at the video game. First thing we need to do is we need to melt our chocolate and our butter, and um, just until it's nice and creamy. All right, so preheat the oven to 350. It might take a little longer, but it doesn't burn as easily on the bottom if you do it so low. So I'm going to just grease my pan with this. A lot of people will put parchment paper in it. I have no luck with parchment paper. I can't get it to behave itself at all. So I don't normally do that and I'll just spray some oil in it to grease it up a bit. the perfect consistency everything is melted but not burnt you always have to be careful because first time I did this I completely burned the bottom of it and it was a little disgusting so I had to start all over so that was a waste of ingredients <laughs> okay so the next thing we're going to add all of the dry ingredients we have our almond flour we have cocoa powder
quicker than the other two. So I'm not going to show you this, but I will lick this spoon. <laughs> so I'm only going to set it for about 20 minutes, and then I'll check it and see if I need longer, uh, just in case. But, oh God, how beautiful that is. Is that yummy looking? Okay, so brownies are in the oven. Uh, it's gonna be more of a low carb one than it is a keto since I added semi-sweet chocolate chips instead of the sugar-free. And then I added some uh, pecans to it, which have a little bit of carbs in it as well, even though pecans are keto. Um, but with this, the uh, chocolate chips, it's less keto than it is um, anything else. So anyway, they're more low carb today than they are keto, but they're still going to be really good. And you would just, uh, not eat a whole bunch at the same time. And yes, those are my dogs in the background. Begging to go out. Oh. Let me out. And yes, I am trying to get a new home for this little guy. I can't see him right now. I don't know about you all, but I swear it's springtime, not fall time. And there she goes, her and her squirrels. Just something about the sound of nature. Hi, buddy. What you doing? My little girl hiding. the brownies are baking. It looks like I have a mess to clean up. I had literally chocolate everywhere. <laughs> You're crazy. So this is why she's going crazy. This is her favorite thing. It's only got four ingredients and so much better than a lot of the treats out there. So this is why she's going crazy. All right, sit down. Here you go, buddy. Brandy's turn. Here you go, girly. Good girl. Nope, you need to sit down first. Calm down. Wait, wait. Oh, crap. Much better. Yep. Nothing like a clean kitchen, you all. Nothing. Much better, Logan. I'm going to leave them in there just a tad bit more since it's still a little too wet for my comfort. Definitely a hit putting those pecans in there. Very yummy. So yummy. 
So guys, I hope uh, you enjoyed this video of me making uh, my brownies. I will post the link down below um, with my recipe so that you guys can go get it and know ex exactly how much I use or what. And um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button on my channel so that you can get a notification of the rest of my videos. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a uh, thumbs up. And um, I will see you all later. Thank you.